my ancestors were not free on 4th of July. The ones that were here, um, many of them were enslaved. When I think of the 4th of July, I think of the journey of um, the soul of America. And I really think about how imperfect our country is and how we have to uh, work constantly towards a more perfect union. Some of the freedoms that we were starting to see are starting to be stripped away. When I was deciding whether or not to have children, I had choices that now my own child in this current political climate does not have. We are taking away the ability for teachers to even talk about diversity, to talk about race in a way that is just historically accurate. On this 4th of July, I lament that we are losing freedoms, but I am also hopeful because I'm watching and I'm listening and I see our younger generation and people in red, wine, and blue and beyond that are fighting to get those freedoms back. So this 4th of July, I'm thinking about um, where we've gone and where we're headed and hoping that we can get back toward a pathway to more freedoms in our country.